Hey, Earth Signs, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. So this spread is called What Do You Need to Know? And this is just a quick um, one, two, three, four, five card spread that gives a little insight into the mutual energy, the past energy, the outcome, what they have going on right now and what you have going on right now. I have pre-shuffled, so let's get into this. So the mutual energy is the Queen of Pentacles. Um, so this is your, you guys, uh, Earth Signs. And this, and this also represents your person's mutual energy. So both of you guys are kind of focused on yourselves and money and your money, your careers, your jobs. They are the king of swords. So they are acting very detached right now. They are the king of swords. You are the eight, of, the eight of pentacles. So you could be working really hard, which goes to that. Uh, you could be working really hard, which goes along with the fact that you are focused on yourself with this queen of pentacles here in the mutual energy. So the outcome is the 10 of swords and we'll clarify that could be dealing with a, um, an air sign. Okay. And in the past, you guys had, you, you guys had, um, some communication in the past. You guys had some communication in the past. You guys could have had some communication about a reconciliation. And the reconciliation maybe didn't go well. Yeah. So you guys had some, so you guys had some, some communication that passed about a reconciliation and someone here chose to miss the opportunity to reconcile or they rejected the reconciliation. So that's what happened in the past, which brings us to the current moment. Okay. So the mutual energy is the, is the queen of pentacles. The mutual energy is the Queen of Pentacles. So both of you guys are actually focused on yourselves and your money and your career, like I said. But also with this Queen of Cups, both of you guys have a lot of emotion for each other. But you're just not offering here with this Queen of Cups because that cup is closed. And you're just kind of looking at the cup. So both of you guys have the emotion. You both feel emotion. But you're just not open to, I guess, sharing and expressing it. I think both of you guys are looking for balance. So you guys are probably looking for balance between work and love. Both of you guys are feeling the, feeling the need to do that. And I feel like both of you guys are also feeling the need to be in a relationship here with this King of Pentacles. This King of Pentacles is normally a husband or somebody that's in, com in a committed relationship. I think both of you guys <clears throat> feel the need to find a relationship that is stable and balanced here. Stable and balanced. Maybe there's a good balance of emotion with that Queen of Cups and work. So they are the King of Swords. So, so they're being really detached right now. Yeah, they're being really detached right now because they want this cycle to end. So they want this cycle to end. They may have some, so you may get some kind of communication from them. Uh, maybe an apology from them with this page of cups. They also could have somebody offering them that page of cups. So they could have somebody offering them something. So there could have been someone that that ghosted them or this could be you coming out of hermit mode here, Virgo. Um, but there could be someone that ghosted them or somebody who's coming back towards them, which it could be you to offer them an apology or a, a love offer here with this hermit and page of cups. This is Virgo energy. But just know if you if this if this is you, they are they are acting cold and attached right now because they they feel like they learned the lesson that they need to learn from this relationship and they want the cycle to be over. They're trying to end it. So you are the eight of Pentacles. Why? Yeah. So you're tired of you, you, you have your head down and you're focused on work. There could have been some real conflict, maybe some arguments going on in your relationship with this person and you're over it. So you don't, you don't want any more conflict. You also could have some conflict going on at work. You could have met this person at work. You could work with this person in this drama at work. Yeah, something. So you're going through a tower moment here. 
So you can have something going on at work currently that's causing a tire moment. So are you dating somebody from your job and it's causing issues at work? You have a lot of options though. Maybe the fact that you had a lot of options is what caused the issue. You got a lot of people fighting over your, fighting to get your attention. You got a lot of options coming in though, earth sign. But right now you're going through a tower moment. So the outcome is the Ten of Swords. So the outcome is the Ten of Swords. Yeah. So you'll be waiting. So you're waiting to be portrayed and backstabbed. You'll be waiting. You'll be waiting. You could be dealing with an Aries. So this person, so this Aries is, is normally a husband, a father, a business person, somebody that's very controlling, very rigid, very authoritative. He takes control. So I see where you may take control of this situation. So you're not, so currently you have a lot going on in your current energy, but I think you're going to get some kind of control over this. I think you may get some communication from this person could be dealing with an air sign, but it won't be the kind of communication that you're looking for because Aries is very, um, is very, uh, rigid. So it'd be very rigid communication. This person could also be watching you, stalking you because that Aries is very controlling. And it'll keep you anxious and in your head. So my advice would be to let this go. I want to know more about what's going on with this tower. So do you have drama with the person's significant other? Cause like I said, that Aries, that Aries is a husband. This King of Pentacles is a husband. This, so are you having drama with somebody? Did they tell you that they weren't in a relationship and they were, and you, and now you have drama going on with the person's significant other? Could be dealing with a cancer, but I see where you're moving forward. You're moving forward because you have a lot of options. You're, you're eventually going to move forward because you got a lot of options. You also could be confused here with the seven of cups. So you could be confused about what direction to take, but I see where, you know, eventually you're going to move forward here with this chariot card. Could be dealing with a cancer. So earth signs, I hope this was helpful for you. I hope this was a good reading. I hope you got out of it what you needed to get out of it. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye.